quick Tony tip for you. When you do a live video, make sure that your speaker is on because if your speaker is off, no one's going to hear anything. <laughs> so this is actually take two. So I want to talk to you a little bit today about the, the five things that successful people do in having successful businesses. Now, this comes from Grant Cardone's uh, 10X Bootcamp. This is day four of the information. And I know this, I'm going to go through these five in a timely manner, but if you don't get all of this, inbox me. I can send you my day four notes that include much more that I'm going to share with you today. So anyway, what are the five, if you will, pillars that you need to have in place to have a successful business? Number one, financial intelligence. You know, um, Robert Kiyosaki in his series of books talks about the ability to raise your financial IQ. I know Tony Robbins' last three books have all about been about raising your financial IQ. So you definitely want to have that in place. You need to know how to manage money. Number two is your marketing genius. Develop your marketing genius. Now, what is that? Your marketing genius is doing things in such a way that people will be attracted to you, that they'll be, they'll come over to your side. They'll want to uh, really get a hold of your influence, get a hold of your ability to bless their lives. Marketing genius, develop your marketing genius. Number three is sales and closing. Now, a lot of people have a, a, a dirty taste in their mouth when it comes to sales. They think it's a bad word, but I'm here to tell you that in sales, all you're doing, well, there's a guy by the name of Peter J. Daniels. He's a billionaire from Australia, and he had the best definition of sales I've ever heard. He said, sales is the ability to tell the truth attractively. Think about that. Sales is the ability to tell the truth attractively. And no matter what you do, it's, it's amazing to me. Sometimes I talk to people and they say, well, I'm not a salesperson. Guess what? Anytime you're sharing your ideas with someone, it could be parent to a child. It could be two friends sharing ideas. It could be a lot of different things. But anytime you're doing that human interaction, guess what? You are selling. You are telling the truth attractively to get someone over to your side. And then the closing part of that is simply helping them to take action on the attractive truth you share with them. So that's number three sales and closing number four is execution actually putting these things into place you know in napoleon hill's book think and grow rich he talks about specialized knowledge and what some people who have read that chapter misperceive is that the specialized knowledge that you have to have to go after your goals and dreams has to be specialized knowledge you have not so the specialized knowledge can come from someone else who has the anointing, who has the ability, who has the background to bring those things into fruition for you so that you can help your business. That dovetails number five I'll get to in a moment. But don't feel like it all has to be on you to have the execution of the plan that you put in place, which leads me now to number five. Number five is to build and scale a team. Now, what does that mean? That means you put in place both internal and external team members to help move you towards your goals. Now, what do I mean by internal? Internal could be people like employees that work with you. It might be people you outsource certain things to, but it's people who report to you in some fashion. External are the support people you put in place. It might be a lawyer. It might be an accountant. It might be things like that, a tax person. It's all the folks that you put around yourself as getting that specialized knowledge to help your business grow. So if you have those five things in place, number one, financial intelligence, number two, marketing, number three, sales and closing, number four, execution. You know, the notes, by the way, they have a great, he has a uh, share some great information on why people don't execute. I'll get that to you when you ask for those um, notes in my private message. And then lastly, build and scale the team. You put these things in place and you have the potential to have a very successful business. This is what Grant Cardone brought to the table that day of day four. Inbox me. I'll get you the day four notes. Have an awesome, blessed day, and we'll talk to you soon. Bye-bye now.